I've been hesitant to cover this topic simply because it's a good way to get your channel struck down. It deals with physical abuse caught live on camera, but also because things didn't look completely valid from an initial viewing. That being said, some new information has come to light and it's about time. I feel safe making the video covering it. As is my usual, relevant clips and pertinent information will be linked in the description of the video itself. Over the weekend, Australian Fortnite streamer Mr. Deadmoth was caught on stream striking his wife, and it came to the forefront in particular when a Twitter user by the tag at RevOCE tweeted the following, Holy fuck, you need to be put down like a sick dog, woman bashing scumbag, at Mr. Deadmoth. He also links to the following clip, which I'm taking from Tipster's video on the subject, because this tweet has since been deleted along with the video itself. Please keep in mind this is rather graphic, so there is a warning here if you don't want to watch it. Can you not? I said I'll be out soon! Stop! No Stop. computer! Stop! Stop! Please! I'll be out soon! <laughs> Just stop! All I asked was for some time by myself. Fucking woman just go away. Out. No one, just go away. Leave me alone. I'll be out soon. How many times do I have to tell you? How many times do I have to Now, it's pretty clear he hits her. There's a clear slap, there's a cry from her, and he's clearly aggravated. On its face, this is pretty damning. However, the problem is that there's no context here, and the majority of outrage is centered around this now deleted clip. The entire incident, however, was captured by someone else, and it shows the preceding events leading up to this moment. Again, it's a bit graphic. We can roof off. We okay, roof come in here. Yes, I'll, I'll be. Yes, yes. Okay, I'll be out soon. Just wait. Jesus Christ! I'll be out. Yes, I'll be out soon. Stop. Stop. I'll be out. No, I'll be out soon. Great. Stop. Stop. I'm serious. You just body just fell over. Can you stop, please? I'll be out soon. Grace, just stop. Okay, please. I'll be out soon. I'm gonna start typing. I'll be out soon. I will be out soon. Grace, I'll be out soon. Fuck off, honestly. I'll be out soon. Stop. I'll start throwing shit back at you. See how you like it. I'll be out soon. I will. Can you not? I said I'll be out soon. Stop. No Stop. computer. I'm Stop. Sick of this shit. Stop. Please. I'll be out soon. <laughs> Just stop. All I asked was for some time by myself. This fucking woman. Just go fucked away. Up. No one. Just go away. Leave me alone. I'll be out soon. As you can hear and see, things are being thrown at him, including what sounds like heavy objects. People are reacting to something that isn't all it appears to be, and that context is necessary to establish that this didn't happen in a vacuum. And even as she's throwing things at him, he doesn't get out of his seat and strike her immediately. He tells her several times to stop. She refuses to, even nonchalantly counting as if she may consider it a joke. Whatever the reasoning here, she instigates the entire thing when she begins throwing things at him. What's more, in both videos, you can see him turn towards her, then back up, bumping into something before delivering the first smack, which points to him possibly reacting to her coming at him aggressively. Now, Twitter and Twitch both deleted his accounts and banned him, and I won't be surprised if Epic Games follows suit soon enough to get ahead of this PR nightmare. The blame is being placed on him for striking her, but as we've just seen, it didn't happen out of the blue. His wife is apparently pregnant, and while that does mess with hormones, it does not excuse her throwing objects at him, nor, apparently, coming at him aggressively. Almost everyone talking about it is saying he should be physically assaulted, or he should never be let out of prison, etc. And apparently, both were charged initially, but the charges against his wife have allegedly been dropped. We can only assume it's based on the edited clip, as well as her gender and the two kids in the house. The legal system generally punishes an instigator before it punishes a victim, and it most certainly punishes an instigator harder if both are held accountable. In this case, it seems like only Mr. Deadmoth is being charged. Now, I'm one of those guys who admits openly that I engage in a double standard when it comes to women. It takes a lot to get me to hit one, 
but there are videos of women out there punching, kicking, and shoving guys only to cry and talk about hitting a woman when the guy responds in the same manner. If you put on your big boy pants, don't be surprised if the guy responds to your physical aggression with aggression of his own. And don't try to hide behind the femininity you gave up when you made the first move. Even Whoopi Goldberg, co-host of The View, agrees with this assessment. You can't try to claim protected status when you start the fracas to begin with. As for the charges having possibly been dropped against her, I can't say I agree with that. She's the instigator, having resorted to violence first. You can't give her a pass just because of her gender. I'm willing to bet the edited video helped her, but once the police see what happened prior, I think they'll reinstate them. Both of them are wrong in this situation. She is when she instigates by throwing objects at him, and he is for allegedly having gone back to strike her again after this incident. It's clear this marriage isn't healthy for either one, and I can only imagine what the children go through. Both should be charged, and both should be punished, in the interest of equality under the law. But I'd like to hear your take. Do you think he's in the wrong? Do you think he should be the only one being charged? Does she deserve charges herself for instigating the entire engagement like I believe she should. Feel free to leave your comments below. Of course, I will be curating if it starts to get a little too bad as I've seen some of my previous videos specifically on an unnamed individual tend to do. That being said, I'm Spectre and I am out.